Good morning, everybody. This is van build number two. This is a 2017 Mercedes Sprinter van, um, the v V6 engine, and it's a shorter version. This is the 144 wheelbase. It has the same configuration as the uh, last one I built, except it's just a shorter one. So the plan for this is to just a simple build with um, the the uh, bed area in, in the back on the back side right here, and to have a shower because. Um, we like to go a short trip camping and stuff and need to have a hot shower after the long day so since this is a uh, shorter one I cannot have the shower on the back here because it's uh, it's not enough room because the wheel well there so I'm gonna try well, we plan to put a shower right here. So this is enough room. It's 27 um, inches by 24 size there. It will fit the shower right here, right behind the bench seat. So, we will see how it goes. As far as the roof, I'm going to remove all these um, original factory paneling and replaced with the uh, wood panels and the LED light and then hardwood floor okay it's gonna be a simple build so follow me First, we are going to remove the the uh, panel, the roof panel, by just popping out these clips right here. This is start from the back of the van, and then just um, try to remove this uh, like more clips inside. Just try to pop them out and then remove these lights. These are easy. You just pop it out and then just disconnect the wires. So we're going to do that. There you go. Panelings are out. Next is the uh, insulation. So far, almost done with the um, insulation. So this is the reflecting. It's what I'm using. Very easy to use. Cut to fit every piece. Okay, to be continued tomorrow. Now the insulation is complete. Next, I'm going to uh, pre-wire before I put the uh, wall panels. These are my wires insulated. What I do is um, right here is a half inch uh, wire insulation. I just um, route the, the two wires inside there. And then I have marked where I want my LED lights and then also the USB port. It's going to be three USB port, one in the back and one here on the side. Hey Ace, hi boy.
Good morning, everybody. Uh, this is a week now. Uh, been building the van. Spent a couple of the time, um, couple hours a day, and today uh, we're done with the wiring. Now I'm gonna focus on the frame before the panel goes up, and we're gonna take a trip to Home Depot. We get some more woods today. So we'll see. I'm gonna help Edge build. Helping her, Edge. You gonna help? Yeah. Yeah? You're gonna help me out? Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Come on. Let's go. Here's the ladder. We're gonna put these wood frames here before we attach the paneling the top. Also, I still need to cut the hole for the fan um, until um, if we have a couple of days without rain, I'm going to do that. Right now, the forecast is rain, but I'm going to focus on the fat paneling. For the panel, I use um, these uh, wood sidings. It has inner lock. It's a 5-inch uh, wood panel from Home Depot. Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> Got to use my new toys for this project. There, my LED lights are up. Today, I got one of the side and the ceiling done. Cause um, I'm, I bought the wrong wood. It, it was a different kind, so was lazy to go back to Home Depot today so I call it today for today but for the most part I got the LED lights installed and this side of the wall is done here you go again I still wait for the fan and here are two LED lights in the front Looking to the front. Okay, progress report. So far, all the wood sidings done. on both sides still the ceiling fan waiting LED lights are good all done and added these control lights light controller for now 
there for the LEDs. Thank you everybody for watching. I'm going to end this episode right now. Uh, next will be the floor and the ceiling fan. As soon as there's no rain, a <laughs> couple days I'll start doing that. So thanks again for watching.